So I grew up Catholic and went to Catholic Church and all was good and fine. And then I met my husband um, and he's Buddhist. So we were kind of looking for somewhere where we could meet in the middle. And I was still searching and a friend of mine asked me to come on a women's Bible retreat. And I went and I was hooked. Each church has its own identity. And this church to me struck as soon as I was here. And the people here were so welcoming to me and my wife. I was born in Vietnam and I'm a refugee. Uh, 1975, my parents, my father was an American GI and my mother was Vietnamese and they, they married. And we escaped from Vietnam on the uh, last day of, of evacuation. People here were so welcoming. It, it, brought, it brought that back to me in my mind. At how when we came over to the United States, my father's family was all there at the airport and they, and they welcomed me. So this church was almost a second wind for me. So. From looking around at six different churches and hoping that we would find a community where we would fit in and be welcome, and now I look six years seven years later, and now it's just ingrained in our lives. And, it, and this church is a part of our everyday lives. I think the way that UDLC works is it's like you can light a thousand candles with one single candle. Sharing happiness is, is never, can never decrease if that's maintained. You know, you can keep things going and going as long as you, know, you have your heart and, and your soul into it. It, it, you can't be stopped. UDLC has empowered me to change the world, to have a place where I can come, recharge, get focused, and then go out and be the best Christian that I can be out in our busy world today.